At any moment, someone in the world could find this wallet here with seven bitcoins. And a lot of people ask me, but is this legal? Is that person stealing? No, no. Those bitcoins are there to be found. There are several wallets out there offering big prizes. This first one starts with seven bitcoins, but the prizes keep increasing. See? The last wallet nowadays has 16 bitcoins. Imagine, man, finding 16 bitcoins. To find it, you run a little program that keeps trying to find it. These days on my computer, I can reach 500 million keys per second. That means every second, it tries 500 million keys. One of those could be the correct key. I'll show you in a bit how I got to that number. But before that, I wanted to show that when we started the channel two years ago, I wrote a totally inefficient code in JavaScript, purely educational, and it ran 22,000 keys per second. Just look at the progress we've made since then. Now I'm gonna show you how I managed to reach those 500 million. I'm gonna quickly stop the program here. And the secret is in this parameter right here. Look, the dash P480. The person who gave me this tip was Andre Martins, who's already given several tips. This guy is really awesome. And this has something to do with threads. I haven't stopped to research it yet, but it's a number you should play around with, right? Depending on your graphics card, this number can be higher or lower to make the search more efficient. But without using this parameter, I was running 200 million keys per second. With this parameter, it's running 500, more than double million keys per second. And if you just landed here on the channel, you're probably going to ask the question everyone asks. Okay, so what if I find one of these winning Bitcoin wallets? What do I do? Well, the first thing you have to do is transfer those Bitcoins. But to do this safely and without complications, check out the videos here on the channel and subscribe so you stay up to date because it's not that simple. But everything is explained in detail. There's a video explaining every single detail. In fact, I even did one of these transfers completely safely to show you how it's done. Look for that video, it's the best of all. And now let's move on to the channel updates, right? Starting with poly marketing, I'm still up $100 in my experiment. All my open bets are in profit. And the Lula bet I made in the last video, it looks like they're going to schedule the meeting. So it's a good thing I closed that one in profit, otherwise I could have ended up losing on that bet. So it's always good when you have a little profit in hand and you're not sure what's going to happen to cash out. It's always a great move. It was great. If you want more details, check out the previous video. And now I'm just left with these bets. I hope everything works out. And the crazy challenges are back, right? I had stopped because of the mistakes. I said that if someone solved the Lego challenges, I would go back to doing challenges. And there you go, here's the challenge. There's probably some mistake, okay? Because I've already given up on making this perfect and error-free, but even with mistakes, people still solve them. And it's 12 BEP39 words in Portuguese. The words are hidden here in this image. It's already dripping. A little bit of Bitcoin has started to come in, right? For those who aren't familiar with the channel yet, it works like this. As time goes by and no one solves the challenge, more Bitcoin gets added there. And it can be quite an amount. I think in the last Lego challenge, there was $500, right? And if no one finds it, it could be even more because that's the money I get from YouTube monetization and put into these challenges for people to solve. So if you're interested, go to the site bitcoinpuzzles.io where you can win both the Brazilian Casetau, which is the channel's own currency, and Bitcoin, which keeps getting added to this prize wallet.